We're rolling. Good morning, nobody. Welcome back to Crimson Cast. We it is uh, Thursday, May twenty first. Other than that, I'm just gonna give it over to Mark because he has something to talk about. But we have a friend of mine on the show today. Tiff, you wanna uh, uh, say some words? May fifth. May fifth. May fifth. <laughs> Now, no one's going to understand that. I know, no one's going to understand the context, but I just wanted to say it anyway. Hello. This, this is my boy. Uh, he's a friend of mine. He's the one who got doing YouTube originally. He's got his channel, which is... Uh, the Real Duck. Over on YouTube or Twitch. One of the two. They're, 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 they both exist, but I'm mostly on Twitch. They're going to be both linked in the description. So... We'll begin. Yeah, there you go. Fancy uh, shiz. Yep. Whole, whole light ad squad. <laughs> Oops, so, say that again. Oh, I said he's a whole like lad. Yeah. So, uh, Mark, you said you had something to talk about. Yes. Um, this game, it came out yesterday. It's called the Cruise, or not the Crucible. It's just called Crucible, and it's Amazon's first major video game. And me and Jaden were talking about it a little bit yesterday, and I think this is an amazing feat for Amazon. And he's just like, no, no, it's. I, I don't think it's that great, mostly because it's just a large corporation trying to make more money than it needs. I'm not a gamer, so games coming out don't make a difference in my life. That's why I really don't care. Yeah, but I don't know. So the mm -hmm. thing with this game is it actually seems pretty interesting. And, like, they have a more... I don't know. They have, like, different ideas that I feel like no, no one has done yet. I'm just saying I don't... I'm not a gamer, so when games come out, it's not big news to me. I'm just like, oh, okay. <laughs> oh, it's out. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's yeah, probably not has, gonna play it, so it don't matter. It has a weird concept, like a a unique concept, a a unique spin on a popular concept. I'm yeah, the a, uh, like the Alpha, Alpha Hunters Crucible. game game. No, it's you basically you spawn into this world in teams, and you have to hunt the other teams and other creatures. On the map. Oh. So, so what makes it so special? I I just think that that's gonna be an amazing playing experience, and I wanna I wanna play that. Like, well, based off of what I was reading, there's three game modes, <clears throat> right? Which is one is the uh, the heart of the hives, which is a four v four battle mode against giant boss hives spawned throughout the world and stuff. Um. Then there's like the Alpha Hunters, which was uh, the eight teams of two against each other. But I think what I was reading about this is like it's basically a battle royale to an extent. But if your teammate was to die, you can apparently like team up with another single team. Like like if a person, so basically if someone had the same situation as you, your other teammate, their other teammate died, you could team up with that person to make a new team. Oh. Is what See, I, I, I was reading a, <clears throat> one of the articles. Because that's the article I, I read idea. just said hunt down opponents and creatures. So I thought it was just all at once, like fight these opponents, like fight these NPCs. I still well, don't. They have that another twist that it has. It's another game mode, mode is the Harvester Command mode. Two teams of eight battle to capture and activate essence harvesters across the map. So maybe that's what you were reading? That possibly could be what I was reading. I mean, I'm looking at it now. <coughs> where they will battle one another in a hunt. They're also... Am ready? This is going to get you excited. Amazon is working on a Lord of the Rings game. Oh. Is this, is this their first game that they've published? Yes. I've they've been, been working on it. A dick over it. What? <laughs> I said, yeah. That's why Mark is like losing his. <laughs> Dude, I'm. I'm just. 
<laughs> you know they like almost double the the worth of the video game like industry now, right? Good for them. Like I said, it's just a billion dollar company trying to make more it's money. It's a one hundred and fifty billion dollar company. So, yeah, it, I can understand where you're coming at, Jay. But like at the same time, I feel like as long as there is some passion into the game, then I can respect them I'm making the game. I'm not saying don't respect it. I'm not a gamer, so video games don't make a difference in my. So hearing about a billion dollar company making a video game is like whoop de doo to me. And they're making more money on top of the money they already made. Yeah, I mean, they're making something, so. It's just not impressive to me. Well, that's... It makes sense that a billion dollar company would want to make video games when anything everybody does nowadays has to do with video games. Well, it's just what's become mainstream. Exactly. That's why it's not impressive at all. I mean, from everything that I've seen, this game is going to be amazing. They've been working on it since 2012. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Huh. Well, they've they've had several... Uh, they've had to like restart it several times because they would lose devs to the bigger gaming companies. All, like, all the time, apparently. And then they put it on oh, a hey, Here you go, I found hmm? the article. Uh, so yeah, Crucible may stand out from other games here as you have the option to team up with another player who has lost their friend and carry on fighting together. Though that temporary friendship will soon come to an end if you make it to the end of the game as someone has to win. So All right. it's like a Hunger Games <laughs> game. Then. Kind of. But so from what I read... So special about it? From what I read, it's kind of like... You don't have to run around and find your equipment. You spawn with, like, a class with abilities and oh. weapons and specific weapons. But you could also probably kill people. I don't know this, but you could probably kill people and pick up their weapons. I'm not 100% sure about so. how the gameplay is going to go. Yeah, I still need to. I, I'm downloading it right now, so I can tell you at some point in the future. But uh, <laughs> well, that's. I want to play it on the channel. Yeah. So. Hmm. Might stream this at some point. Maybe we can all play together, except Jaden because he seems like a sour butt. <laughs> <laughs> Not a sour butt. It's just video games don't impress me really anymore. Being an adult sucks. It takes away the joy in everything <laughs> you do. So, I'm just forever gonna be a child. Bah a humbug! It's cause your brain is underdeveloped, Mark. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Wow. <laughs> you guys hear get how burned. mean he is? That is, get burned. I haven't talked to you in like a week, so I'm just gonna get all my trolling <laughs> and insults out now. <laughs> oh <Get> man! Burned. <laughs> so, what else are we talking about? Is that all we had to talk about? Well, I woke up Good to a really, <laughs> a really scary article on my phone this morning. Oh, lovely! What happened? There now? was a shooting at a naval base. Oh, like a civilian. A new one. Like a civilian went there and shot up. The naval basin was quickly apprehended. And I was just like, well, no shit. He was quickly apprehended. Why would you want... Why? 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 That's a that why would, military why base, naval base out of all where, they where they train people to kill other people. Like... Was there a reason behind it? Or are they just looking for a death wish? I have no idea. They said that... It, unknown. Because they just gunned him down. They didn't... Like ask any questions. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, I, 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 ask questions I, 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 if some figured, dude is shooting guns at your dude, military base. Apprehended, and I was like, apprehended, huh? He wasn't gunned down on the side. Well, that's he was attacking a military base. What's a yeah. military's first reaction when they're getting attacked? I, I Shoot figured, back. I figured he was going to be gunned down, but when you said apprehended, it confused me because apprehended does not mean killed; it means arrested. 
You know, well, you know maybe he just arrest. Maybe they just arrested his dead corpse. You know. <laughs> well, I'm just saying it threw me off. <laughs> In jail for you, buddy boy. Jail for you, even when you're dead. <laughs> just leave the corpse. In a jail cell. cell. It's like gonna be like Skyrim, where just you find skeletons and chilling in the <laughs> Exactly, <laughs> exactly like Skyrim. Just like, like that. Just, just exactly. This I I remember the scene perfectly in Skyrim where you attack a naval base. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's a navy in Skyrim. A navy is just water armies, boat armies, water, water creatures. Navy. Navy Not things. water creatures, but there's boats in Skyrim. There's pirates. Pirates are a naval, not government run, but naval esque. Yeah, they have a hierarchy and <clears throat> like a. They run the oceans. So it is kind of weird navy. how pirates have a hierarchy. Like you would think. There's pirate lords. Yeah. No, I mean like they're they're very respectable people, considering that they steal and loot all your. Well, I'm a respectable uh, person, and I love looting. My my whole thing is, I think it was like they didn't attack other pirates unless they had some beef right. with that pirate kind of thing. Pirates are all yeah, yeah, yeah. It was more of like a like a trust pact kind of thing. It's yeah. like I won't attack you if you don't attack me. Yeah, it's like when gang members are like, if you don't fuck with us, we, we don't fuck, fuck with you. With you. Don't forget fuck about butterflies. it. Don't fuck with the butterflies. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, did Tiff tell you that we're gonna all play GTA and be the butterfly squad? Butterfly, uh, yeah. GTA. Bro, we've been playing. You guys gotta hop on with us. GTA we're, 5? We're going to. Uh, Mark said that he couldn't download it for some reason. I don't have enough space on my computer, so I bought an external Oof. hard drive. It's getting delivered today. Oh, there you go. <laughs> well... I'm gonna have to see if I can run GTA again on my computer. <clears throat> That's Hell definitely yeah, getting bro. recorded. GTA videos yeah. coming up with Tiff. Tiff will be in them. Hell yeah. Tiff boy, and probably like a thousand other people. <laughs> uh, it's gonna be a shit show. No, I. It did get a little chaotic when we did the stream, so I mean, we'll probably I mean, <laughs> we'll probably won't do too many. Every time you guys are on a stream together, it's nothing but chaos. Too much people. Too much, too much people, too Luigi. Much, too many mans. Too many. I gotta water my plant. What? <laughs> oh. I got a little plant on my desk. <laughs> <laughs> just, you said too many, and then just like had a two second gap, and then said you gotta water your plant. I was like, what? I don't know. What plant do you have on your desk? I don't remember I've, seeing a plant. I have a spider plant, dude. I'll literally send you a picture. Oh of it yeah, right you now. told me about. No, oh, you told a me about spider it plant. He's in a little turtle. Yeah, you showed me that last time. I was oh, there. that's the spider plant. You looked it up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I would have got it if you guys said its actual name. The Chlorophintium comosum. Como oh, oh, yeah, because that's a well-known name for a plant. <laughs> <laughs> I it's know also known as the airplane word. plant. The airplane huh. plant? What? Or the St. Bernard's lily. The spider ivy, the I've ribbon plant, Saint Bernard's lily, and hen and chickens is a species of perennial flowering plant. Apparently, I don't know. Bought thanks, thanks Google. <laughs> That's gonna be the <laughs> name of today's you episode. Mother... Botany with Crimson Craft. <laughs> we'll have your mom do a gardening episode. <laughs> My mom would have a heyday. Oh no. <laughs> Well, that's, my mom has a degree in agricultural really? architecture. What? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, she went to college. She went to college. I didn't <laughs> doubt she went to college. I was. I didn't know she had a degree in agricultural stuff. Agricultural Man. architecture. So she's the really good at. Was there, so what I said was that. <clears throat> yeah, she's basically a glorified gardener. <laughs> yeah, she's a professional gardener. <laughs> <laughs> That's how much she does oh, for work, man. though. But she enjoys doing it, so she just does it as a hobby. 
<laughs> Fair enough. I need a new hobby. You are a hobby. Oh, oh that's a burn. <laughs> Is it though? Sometimes. You're a Everybody hobby, that means people hobby. like doing you. Yeah, so how is that an insult? You ho. I'm okay with this. Why, why, why must the word ho be uh, provocatory? You why whore. can't I look at it in a nice way? What are you even saying? I don't know, I'm half asleep right now. Bro, same, you guys, like I woke up like maybe an hour ago. Or I've been getting up at like 5.30 the past couple of days because of work. Oof. I'm half dead. I haven't been going to sleep at like 5.30. If I'm up by 5.30 in the morning, if I'm up, my rule is if no, I, I go to bed by 4 o'clock in the morning, I'm staying up all night. Because if I go to bed then, I'm never going to wake up. <laughs> or just when die. I do wake Fair up, enough. I'm going to be exhausted. So if, if I'm up till 4 in the morning, I'm just not going to bed. And then just drinking a shit ton of coffee. Hell yeah! Sounds like a plan. Good. Drink that coffee, homie. Ugh. Coffee fee. Coffee fee. Coffee fee. I'm suing. You're suing. You're suing. <laughs> Take it over, Skeeby. Who? He doesn't know who Skeeby is, Mark. We can't explain now. You have to go watch our <laughs> videos now. All of yeah. them. May 5th. You are now obligated to go watch all of our videos. Nah, dude, May 5th. Figure out who Skeeby is. <laughs> you fucking May 5th thing so dumb. I don't know why I'm still talking about it. I don't, I don't know what you're, lo you're loving the joke, and I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> because it makes my dumb. brain ain't function. <laughs> Makes Did Tiff feel smart. Function? <clears throat> so what's our next topic, huh? Hmm? What are we talking know. about? We didn't have this very planned out. Uh, oh no. Because we were supposed to do this yesterday. Yeah. I'm a guest star on a Just... show you didn't even plan out. What is this? <laughs> yeah, you, you got yourself into a world of trouble here. Tiff. Oh man. We're gonna tear you down. I re regret everything. You got <laughs> you any should. questions for me, maybe? <laughs> Um, I don't know. Um, I have no idea. Did you hear about what they added in the new, in the new Minecraft snapshot? I didn't know no. it came out. Yes, yeah, I didn't know that either. I haven't been playing Minecraft. Whoa! I figured they were done with updates. Due no. To the fact that Ready? Bug state. Ready? They converted dimensions. To be a database file that you can change. I don't, I don't know. know what any of that means. You can alter huh. the nether. You can add dimensions and you can like code your own way to be able to get to that dimension. So yeah, Mark, yeah you can add your own English dimension trees. basically. That, that is literally, I can add dimensions. Instead of adding mods that add a dimension, you can straight really? up just download a dimension <laughs> file and put it in your Minecraft world. That is sweet. Weird. And kind of cool. And Mojang set up a website where you can do it yourself. Oh, that's awesome. How yeah. have I not heard about that? I probably did hear about it and not knew what any of it. Means. It came out yesterday. But do you want to talk about the possibilities of that? You, we're going to abuse well, the fuck Did you out see of <clears throat> Yes, did we you are. see the thing they did uh I think it was for like April Fools or whatever. Um, or something. It was. It was. They did something. Oh, I don't remember the, why they. The but infinite they dimensions. Made the, the books. But yeah, oh, they, cha yeah, they changed yeah, the dimension yeah, that, every time. That, that was. For, I uh, wonder if that was them building up for this. It was probably them trying to test it to make yeah, sure it worked. Yeah. That's, that is, really that's cool. probably most likely what it was was them testing the ability and how we would react to it. Well, that's, it's something the community has been asking for for a long time. So you can add the na the Aether and stuff. and Because they there didn't want to add... Years. What? Hello? Hmm? I said hello. He was in the middle of yes. talking. I can't hear him. Yeah, I don't hear him either. 
But back to what I was saying, like, instead of having a mod that adds the Aether, you just add the Aether dimension, because we've been asking for more Hello? dimensions. Hello? Yeah. I said they were supposed to add the Aether mod in years ago, but now they have the guy that made working for them. Well, that's... No. They didn't... They didn't want to take away from the creativity of the guy who created the Aether, so... They hired him. They hired him. Yeah, I know this. That's what I the just said. The question is... Um, now, they're just adding the dimension, though. They're not adding new items. That's... Right. The next The next thing is custom items. Making items oh. database <clears throat> files that you can change. Which... So Some of them already are. Months? What? Is that going to halt the modding process then? If you can just do it's it. It's going to make the time. modding process more drawn out, it's but you really won't need. The modding process now? You won't need things like Forge. Because they'll just be data okay. files that you can insert into your game instead of yeah, a it's... new file that your computer has to run on a different running operating system i don't really know how to explain it do you a think different... that would slow things down more or speed i think do you think it, having something probably make like things easier because it's integrating everything it's, yeah it's, it's making it's it all in one it... central hub instead of going through a complicated mess of download yeah like it'll make things easier for modders too because say you just want a, a mod that adds specific weapons and you download, or you don't even want the mod, you just want a specific, like, sword made out of, because it looks cool, right? You could just download okay. the file for that sword instead of the whole mod, or all of the files. And you could pick and choose which swords you want from this file that you can download. So they're, they want to do it with items, they want to do it with blocks. They did it with dimensions. I'm assuming they'll do it with mods as, as well. Yeah. I assume so. I, I have a feeling when they heard Hightail was coming out, they're like, okay, now we gotta fix it. <laughs> we gotta yeah. step up our game. And they, I'm, they saw Hightail was coming, and they're like, okay, motherfuckers, you're not beating us. You think less, you're gonna beat They were like, it's time to dance. Like, Yeah, it's like, you wanna dance, bitch? Let's dance. Let me show you how Sweden works. Let me show you how Sweden works. And it, it doesn't help that they're owned by one of the most like rich companies in the world like oh yeah microsoft dude yeah so they just have like all the resources in the entire world at their disposal <clears throat> and i'm they should have done this a long time ago i think like this is something that should have happened when the game came out true, true. but i feel that it wouldn't well, have happened. There's no such thing as foresight in real life, so well, they couldn't see what was gonna happen. Yeah, it wouldn't have happened without a, a game coming to compete against them. Yeah, something had to trigger the outcome. And nothing had come out in the past 12 years that would have made Minecraft go into, like, overpower mode. Besides yeah, Hightail. Now that Hightail's gonna try to give them a run for their money, they're like, well, now we gotta step our shit up. Which is kind of funny, considering that Hightail's made from guys who use their own use their game yeah, to make like yeah. servers and stuff exactly yeah which is i i think it's hilarious because they oh, learned oh. on minecraft and then took that knowledge and applied it on their own in their own purposes so, i didn't realize this but apparently hypixel is getting funding and exist and assistance from riot games i don't yes. know what that is Oof. Uh, Riot Games made, um, like, League of Legends and uh, Valorant. Okay. Huh. If you say so. I don't know what engine it's gonna run on either, but, um, I assume Java. It's planned to be released for Microsoft and Windows in May, in, in not May, sorry. In 2021. Do you think <clears throat> oh, it's going to be back. Java? Because I, I figured since Minecraft is on I Java... I highly doubt it would be with Java. That's what I'm saying. I think they can, like, a to real do engine? Since Minecraft is they, on it, most like the Unreal Engine, because the Unreal Engine is very, like, universal for game making, and it's, like, kind of weird. Well, like, how yeah, well... but... <clears throat> what else are they going to use? That's, whole, that's, like, my question. Um, well, I highly doubt they would use Unity. Mm -hmm. What? Well, yeah, that could, could also just come up with their own. own. 
Yeah. Hmm. It's weird. Yeah, I haven't been on the high tail. No, it fell anymore. off the wayside for a while. I stopped hearing about it forever. Well, the only time I hear about it now is when me and Mark talk about it. They put out information <clears throat> saying... Or they put out a statement saying that they don't want to release information until it's like 100% finished for the final game. Like, finished to be released. So they're not going to yeah, release no, you. Not very... Any more updates anymore? No. They're very conservative that on what they, sucks. like, let out. Because originally they had updates coming out, like, weekly. Well, yeah, but then they realized that <clears throat> they were focusing more on putting out content and updating uh, people than they were on actually making good content and update updates for the game. Yeah, that makes sense. So, they wanted to shift more towards taking their time, making sure the game was good, which it makes sense, but it sucks because I want to see what they're doing. Yeah, I want to see the uh, growth. Have you seen... That's what's great about Minecraft, is Minecraft isn't a finished product, so we get updates constant we get to watch the growth of the game because the game's not technically finished yeah and it never will be until the company says so cool is that the whole time playing it since it's been out it's never been a finished product because we yeah, it gives constantly. more playability because yeah. then if you leave it for a while they're like oh we got this new update it's like oh shit let me go back to and minecraft that's, that's why minecraft got so popular all of a sudden because all of the updates <laughs> kept coming out I feel like Minecraft's a weird one because I don't feel like they'll ever officially Out finish it. I <clears throat> I don't want them to, but I also don't want them to overdo it. Yeah, I agree with that. Like because I think the Nether update is badass and everything, but I feel like it. Uh, in my mind, it's kind of too much all at once, all of a sudden. Yeah, you know what I mean, I mean, like I think the I think the update's cool as fuck, but with the past updates we've gotten, this update seems so much more grandiose than usual. Well, yeah, they've probably just been working on the smaller updates, and then we're like super working on this one, waiting for this one to finish, and then boom, busted well, it out. <clears throat> this one, they said that they've been looking to do it for a while so they wanted to make a big deal out of updating the nether and i think they freaking yeah, nailed it they hit the nail yeah, right I'm on not, the freaking head it's a problem i'm not saying it's a problem i didn't say it was what i'm saying is it seems like a lot all of a sudden it does given what we it's overwhelming is what you're saying yeah yeah it's overwhelming it's an overwhelming amount of things to add at once yes but i think wish about things Think about newer players that don't know anything, or think about older players that know too much. It's gonna confuse them. Well, yeah. It's just thrown in their face. The, the thing is, though, you can also load on older versions still, so oh, it's yeah, not I like... Know. I'm playing currently on 1.12.2 because I'm not... <clears throat> yeah. So, like, if you wanted to learn some, like, the old stuff and start going throughout the ages of the Minecraft, then you can at least go to the older version. Yeah, that doesn't make the, uh update any less overwhelming though no uh, yeah i get what you're saying but that's a, i also i'm get, not saying it's wrong people the opportunity to i'm just saying it seemed like so much more all of them. yeah that's i wish mojang would put out when they were doing updates updates with this much content so people would be used yeah. to it by yeah, now exactly that's the point on me that's exactly the point yeah I'm making. i i can see where you're coming from usually aren't this large well, and game break. They they did do the the biome update was a pretty big one. Yeah, but was, it's, was that, it biome. only added like three biomes. This one added three biomes and a whole different like li like they made it livable in the uh, Nether. Oh, didn't they remove the pigmen? Yeah, they removed zombie pigments and added two new factions. Another mob. Oh, what the hell, bro? I haven't played the new. Dude, I didn't know it was like factions and stuff. Yeah. Load up the new Nether, or load up the newest version of Minecraft, or the like newest snapshot. Go into creative mode, build yourself a Nether portal, and step through it. You will be yeah. your mind will be blown with what they've done with this game because it's amazing. If you don't wear gold, you're gonna get your face. 
punched in. Yeah. Piglins, they like gold, but they'll attack you if you don't have any on. Or if you steal it from them. Yeah. Or if you open a <laughs> chest. A hard way. What's the newest version? I don't even know. It is... Not, or, uh... 20W21A? I believe that's this mm -hmm. version. Okay. I, I think no I have to put on... Weird. I'm currently playing modded right now, so I don't have... Oh, I don't have that liberty because I'm staring at the logo right now. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my phone? Oh, 20W21A. Yeah, here we go. Alright, fuck it. I'm gonna load it up and see what you're talking about. Dude, it's... You're gonna- your you mind's gonna be blown. should play, my guy. Hell yeah, brother. We need I, mean, I could load up a- Skeeby needs to edit some of our MC videos that we have backed up because we need to start recording again. Who the fuck is Skeeby? <laughs> our editor. Our editor. <laughs> our editor and producer of the channel. Oh, Follow him on Instagram and Twitter. Skeeby.com uh, Skeeby Crimson. Skeeby underscore Crimson. Yeah, something like that. Legit, legit. Yeah. Editor, producer, main, kinda. He's just chill guy, chills around, does some things. Yells at us. Yeah, he yells at us. Get back to work sometime. Judges our stupidity. No, he mostly oh, yells at us when we're all stupid. He doesn't yell at us to get back to work, he just yells at us that we're stupid. You're the biggest dumb boys I've ever seen! We usually have to yell at him to get back to work. Like, like, Skeeby, what are you doing? Where's our videos, man? They We're like, Skeeby! He's like, I've been busy. And I'm like, well, stop being busy, and we need videos edited. We have a vlog that has to go up. I just loaded up Minecraft, and the only world I have saved on here is called Bitches and Hope. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Gorgeous. I love it. Amazing. Right, let me see here. It's a beautiful, beautiful set. <clears throat> me and Tiff haven't played Minecraft together in a hot-ass minute. Hell yeah, brother. I know Tiff's got that, the SMP with the mods, but I want to play SMP without mods. Like, on the, on the Earth map. Um, yeah, the Earth map kind of, like... Sucks. Yeah, it's not that good, though. Really? Like, it's it's interesting, like, when you first start, and then you're, like, you just lose all interest, like, pretty yeah, quick. Yeah, it like, gets old quickly. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't able to run all of the mods properly. I enjoy modding. I want to see what mods are going to come out. Shit. I want to see. I want to doing... see what they're going to do with these dimensions, honestly, because you're going to be able to download these dimension packs instead of mod packs. And it's going to be weird because without changing any of the gameplay at all or any blocks in the game, there's going to be added dimensions. This is going to be an interesting, uh... Actually, that could be... It's really interesting, because I wonder how they're going to do, like... Like, you know, the, the story worlds that people create? Yeah, that's it. Um, <clears throat> because they can integrate, like, teleportation into a dimension as, like, a story element. Yeah, that's... You can use command blocks and teleport between the dimensions that are... They added a new command. You can now teleport between dimensions. I don't know how to use command blocks, really. That was never something I avidly got a chance to use in Minecraft. That's... I've only ever used them for... Remember when Captain Sparkles used to do the uh, command block? Uh, was it Captain Sparkles that did it? Yeah, oh, he used to do the command the... blocks to teleport. No, the... the Wait, it, it, where they uh, added the weird stuff in, yeah, like the yeah, stuff yeah. that didn't make sense to the game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I know you're talking about without I any mods. That for a little while back when I had my uh, back when I played on Pocket Edition. What the hell? Warped Nylium? 
the hell is this shit? <laughs> Tiff's like, I don't know what to do here. Tiff's big boomer with this. You should go watch the structure we built. Wrong. Yeah, go crying go obsidian. Survival. Uh -huh. Crying well, obsidian. Actually, technically, crying obsidian was supposed to be in the game a long ass time ago. Yeah, it was actually in the beginning of the Pocket game. Pocket edition. It, Ooh, it was in the game before the Nether got added. Yeah, because it was what the Nether core burnt out into. Huh. <clears throat> Remember the fucking nether core? Yep. Nether reactor core? Mm -hmm. You remember that? You run around I like a fucking madman trying no not to get squashed by zombie pigmen who used to be hostile. I bet these kids have no idea what we're even talking oh, about. Yeah. You don't know. I mean, kids of all ages. What? <laughs> they don't know. They don't know anything. Dude, they don't know the struggles. <clears throat> what the hell? This looks really cool. Right? Dude, yeah, I I think it's their best update that they've put out so far. Like, I think they outdid themselves. They didn't I update... The basalt and stuff looks amazing. Yeah. We used basalt... We're using basalt in our survival world to build the walls in our basement. Huh. We're using yeah, some of the blocks are really nice. We're using basalt, crying obsidian, and gold, right? We're using basalt, crying obsidian, and blackstone. Blackstone. That's what it is. Which is the cobblestone of the nether. Yeah, because the nether is survival up until, like, iron, because I think you can only get diamonds in chests, and that's only a chance. Yeah. And then you have nether to get gold. Nether, right? Yeah. yeah. Dude. They added weapons and armor that are better than diamond. Huh. It's called netherite, and you find them underneath lava lakes. So you have to, like, tunnel down and just mine around at bedrock. It's insane. It's insane, bro. It's sunshine! And shine it's a membrane. It's mad. It's mad. Aren't we all? Sometimes. I mean, sometimes, yeah. So Once a mad man, always a mad man. Once so, a man, always a mad What? 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 <laughs> you talking <laughs> shit? <laughs> Pardon my friend, he's a duck. So he has a duck around <laughs> and he doesn't know what to think. Okay. Quack. 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 Oh, wait, I got you guys. Quack. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a sound button? <laughs> Can you just yes. show me how to attach... Remember the voice mod pro that we were dicking around with? Voice mod? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you need to show me how to attach it to my Discord because it won't let me use it with Discord. Oh uh, yeah, it's a little wonky. If, yeah, I can I can help you with that. I mean, I got more quacks. You want more quacks? <laughs> Our channel is gonna hate. It. That's tiff. It's okay. I'll stop it. <laughs> I got a bunch of other stuff. Like, uh, let's see. Do it. I didn't say stop. I didn't say stop. You gotta do it. You gotta. You gotta. Hello there. Hello there. Wow, uh, Kenobi. Wow. I got a wow. I got the Pokemon theme song. Got it. We were playing Pixelmon the other day, and we were singing the Pokemon theme song like a bunch of dweebs. Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. It, Pokemon. In the video. <laughs> Skeeby just like no. Stop. No one ever was. Bam, 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 bam. The three <laughs> of us should do a Pixelmon series. P 
pixel mans with the mods and the pixels. Yeah, I have a I have a mod pack I can give you guys that adds a uh, bunch of like different anime mods, One Piece, Pixel Mon, Dragon Ball Z. We'll do well, a, like a uh, 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 series like that if you guys want. I I don't know how to add mods to a server, so huh? you just need to install the the forge to the server file, and then it will make a mod. English. You're talking to people that don't know anything about shit like that. Wait, you have a server, right? Like yeah. already? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so yeah, you, all you need to do is just. But you, you know how you install Forge? Like you would install on your normal computer? Yeah. No, well, I don't remember. Uh, oh well, it it's just a simple install, basically. Yeah. And you I run the install that. file, and it's instead of putting it to your your computer, you set it to the server folder. Oh, the second option! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh! Oh. Uh... Okay, okay, I know what to do then. I feel really dumb. <laughs> we could have been doing this years ago. So I we mean, could be playing I, modded I Minecraft the, the whole time. Hold up. Let's say. Yeah, we could have we been playing modded Minecraft. This. I'm sorry, nobody. This is. Well, you can kiss our survival up. series no. goodbye now. Yeah, we're gonna get, we're gonna start modding. You're Except welcome. We, we have some footage backed up, so you'll have footage while oh, we try yeah. to figure it out. Well, no, we, we can keep this world since it's the snapshot world. We can just do a modded series when we get fed up with the Nether, I guess. Yeah. That's Which I have a awesome. feeling is gonna be very soon. Yeah, probably. I enjoy modding way more than I like the vanilla base game. <laughs> but what if I can add a dimension? If I figure out how to oh. do that, add a bunch of We're not dimensional on that. time jumping or something. We're gonna jump dimensions, people. We're gonna play Rick and Morty. <laughs> Rick, do you, have you guys watched any of the new episodes? I haven't yet. I have not. I'm waiting for them to come on Hulu. Well, you can watch them on um uh, on uh, AdultSwim.com. The new episodes I can watch on AdultSwim.com. Yeah. Why didn't this I know this? Like I've been watching them. This sounds like a plug for a... <laughs> AdultSwim.com? Yo, like, I can watch all the new episodes on AdultSwim.com. Link in the description. You just need to go to the URL, AdultSwim.com. To... <laughs> Link in the description. <laughs> Hashtag not actually sponsored. Hashtag you can sponsor us if you'd like to, because I love Adult Swim and Robot Chicken is, like, the best. Hashtag please do. Pay me money. No, but yeah, 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 that's where I watch them. All right, I didn't know I could do that. The more you know. Wow. Knowing is one know. eighth of the battle. I guess I know what I'm doing tonight. Binge watching all of the new Rick and Morty episodes. Yep. Hell all yeah. <laughs> all of them. So I'm just gonna wait till they go on Hulu. I got <laughs> Carly hooked on Avatar. <laughs> It's about damn time. We're not turning this to an Avatar series, Mark, as much as you'd like. No, it's Avatar not that I... It's channel. just... just I love Avatar, but we spend way too much time talking about it. No, <laughs> I'm making a point. I'm telling a story. <laughs> Jesus. Story time. He's getting all salty about Avatar. I'm not getting <laughs> salty. Nothing I said was had any salt in it. It was as bland as a white old lady. <laughs> That's racist. No, That's it's not. Sexist. I'm white. No, it's not. I'm white. Prove it. Has to change the sexism part, but okay. I didn't say it wasn't sexist. I said it wasn't racist. Yeah, well, I said sexism, sexism is a form of racism. It's not sexist. You said you're white again, and I was like, what? <laughs> nah, nah, it's not sexist. It's, it's joke, a joke. I kid, I kid. I know. All of your... So do I. It's all of your... But like, no hate mail, please. You're gonna get some hate mail. I'm gonna, gonna give gonna you us. some hate mail, dude. Do it. You don't know my address. <laughs> I, I'll figure it out. I'll have Jake deliver it to you in person. <laughs> I'll just walk to your house. Be like, hey, I got you a death threat. <laughs> here's your uh, here's your honorary death threat and your. Uh, and it's just like, I don't know. We know we made a death threat. 
and it just says to Mark, and then in the corner it just says Tiff. <laughs> just Tiff, and I'm threatening you with death. <laughs> oh man! Death by duck sauce. Death I'm gonna by drown duck. you in some duck sauce. Damn! What a way to go. I'm what a delicious way to sauce. go. It's it's pretty Wait. good, but I get sick of it very quickly. It's very sweet. It's like you'll get sick of it while you're drowning in it. Is but, it meant um, to be she... eaten on duck, or is it made out of duck? I have no idea. Or is duck just a Chinese word that I don't know? I probably don't eaten. wanna know. You probably Tiff, don't wanna know. I don't know. I don't wanna Google. That's probably that's wanna something know. I don't wanna know. China what is where is duck sauce. They eat like pangolins and stuff. Pangolins are like the cutest things on earth. They're little scaly armadillos. Oh, pangolins! Oh, scaly, adorable. I know who you're talking about now. Yeah, they're in the ant what eater is family. Duck sauce. <laughs> really? I thought they were in the armadillo family. Well, armadillos are also in the ant eater family, I believe. Oh, well, I didn't know that. What is duck sauce? It has to do with their whole, like, living strategy, I believe. Is they all scavenge for ants and they use their tongue to, like, reach into the ant hills and... Oh, that was a bad idea. Scoop up all <laughs> them ants. What? Give me an answer. Uh, I know I'm what it Minecraft. is. What is it made yeah, of? Yeah, I made Minecraft now. <laughs> like, this is where this podcast is went, is I'm in Minecraft now. <laughs> Oh, it's soy sauce, mustard, hot sauce, or red chili powder. And it's used to gl as a glaze on food. So probably it got its name from being used as a glaze on despite, duck. Despite its name, the sauce is not prepared using duck. Yeah, but Damn. Was, if given its name, Good. it was probably prepared for a duck. True. Because they ate duck. They eat duck. Yeah, it's a very big delicacy kind of thing in China. It's used for deep fried dishes such as wonton strips, spring rolls, egg rolls, duck, chicken, fish, or with rice or noodle. Yeah. It's not. Like. My aunt uses it when she makes spring rolls. And she's Filipino. So. Filipino. Yeah, I'm Wait, not Filipino. <clears throat> Warp stem? Can you turn this into wood? Yes. Yes. Bro, this, this is so cool. Look at the new doors. The purple one is really nice. Wait, there's new doors as well? What? There's oh my new, god. From the, the new woods, they have all their, all the stuff. Like stairs, fences, there's wood. Blue. Or doors, there's gates. Blue fire. Yeah, there's blue. There's a, door. there's a new procedurally generated Structure. Uh, structure. Oh, we got the fancy ass walls too, bro. Yeah. yeah. Oh, put walls. Use the walls with glass panes. You can actually make, make walls wall. out of walls now. Make a wall, and put a window in that wall using wall blocks. Just, just do it. Do it for yourself. You're gonna love this. I'm <laughs> doing it. Doing it up. <gasps> yes. Right. Right. <laughs> uh, that was like a. That's oh, how I built, oh my that's how god! That's how I built my house and our survival. That's amazing. Theory. I need to yeah. figure out how to cap my house and. You haven't done any. All we've been working on is the basement of your house. My you house has a work. weird tower structure and two blocks going around, or three going around the shape of the house. I play now. There's a door. Even I'm playing Minecraft right now. Bro, what does this podcast become? I'm just playing Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> we we can't record a new video until Skeeby edits the uh, ones we have. We have no room. Unless you want to do. Unless you want to start up your server and we can just play. Um, Are you talking to me or We him? don't want to do any TIFF. My, my server is currently set up on FTB Ultimate Reloaded, but I do need to change it to because we're doing a build challenge later today. Oh, nice. I mean, I'm going boop, boop, fishing, boop. so I'm going to go fishing. In Minecraft? No.
No. <laughs> <laughs> We'll catch some he has a light fish. outside of Minecraft. <laughs> Dude, it would have looked tormenting fish for some reason. <sighs> Bro, this guy, I'm calling PETA. It's not. Let's call PETA. Call PETA. I dare you. Fishing is considered humane. Yeah, it's because PETA is double standard. You're just. Yes, yes, they do. You're just tormenting fish, you evil, cruel man. You're giving them lip piercings involuntarily. Well, they're the ones that eat the hooks. Like, have you seen some of the bait that I use? Like, yeah. why would you eat you this? Fail. Why would you eat Se this? Several times. Why would you eat this? I mean, the weird fishy why would dudes. dogs eat dog food? It appeals to them somehow. Yeah, but this is like a plastic rubber worm that doesn't look like... <laughs> <laughs> they live in a world where plastic doesn't exist. They live in a world with worms, dude. Is. Worms like that at that size you can't, don't originate in we the have water, common, man. We have common sense. You cannot blame something that is not bred with common sense for not knowing something. If you do not get taught what something is, you cannot be blamed for not knowing it. Damn, preach, brother. Yeah, but he should be afraid. He should be afraid. Dumb. He should be afraid. I should be afraid. What? 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 Oh, they should be afraid. Yeah. I heard he should be afraid. I was like, what? Yeah, I heard he. <laughs> That's like, like, what? I'm afraid, <laughs> boy. Threat? No. It is now. Ooh, don't threaten me with a good I won't, because <laughs> I don't know you. Except you know me very well. If you oh. want to torture, if you want to kidnap and torture Jaden, ourselves together back in the day. Wait, you know, what? Like last year. What? What are you talking about? Oh, I, I was gonna make a joke. I was gonna really like, to if Donald you were gonna time. kidnap and torture Jaden, you shouldn't oh, lock him up in your basement channel, because he'd probably no, we enjoy didn't make that. A channel. We put it all up on yours. Hey, okay. Nobody acknowledged what I just said, and I thought it was I didn't, hilarious. I didn't hear. You, you, you I cut didn't out. Hear anything. Oh. I said, um, when you were talking, like, don't threaten me with a good time, I was just like, well, if you want to torture Jade, kidnap and torture Jaden, you shouldn't lock him up in your basement, because he'd probably enjoy that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Lack of sunlight, man. Vampires don't like sun. Basements are nice. No. You're if you really basement. want to torture him, you gotta force him to read a book. Um, actually, you'd be wrong there, because I used to read all- I just can't now, because I'm, like, festered with ADHD and dyslexia. You literally wouldn't read an article that took me two seconds to read. Because I'm dyslexic, and I can't read it. Choosing not to read. Tiny, tiny writing. Yeah, I get tiny it. Tiny writing is hard for me to read, because my letters get drunk. Make it bigger! Zoom it in! Zoomity zoom! Zoom 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 zoom! Zoom zoom! Zoom zoom zoom! He's like, you want me to send you the article I just read? I'm like, no, I'm not reading. <laughs> <laughs> I refuse. Don't make fun of me. Aww, I'm disappointed and sad. Why are you disappointed and sad? I was hoping that the thing would wrap around the doors. What? The oh, yeah, yeah, the fence. I made that mistake, too. Man. Maybe next time. Oh, but when you close the door, it does. The hell? Or when you open it, I mean. You should def go watch Wait, our what? episodes and see how my house turned out using that strategy. Can I? Oh, no, that didn't work. Never mind. Oh, I was like, ooh, what'd you find out? What did you learn? <laughs> Tell me, boy! <laughs> Tell me what you've learned. <laughs> what secrets do you hold in that brain sack what of yours? of you... <laughs> nah, I thought... I, I tried I tried a thing, but it didn't work, and I thought it did. And then I got sad when what it What news of the new world do you have? Well, I think that bees fly. That's my Not name. the bees. <laughs> Not the bees. Bees fly. But it Have should be physically impossible. How do they Stop do it? 
stop trying to quote B movie. But I love movie that has to do with bees. You like jazz? You like jazz? <laughs> I don't have that in here. <laughs> you like sound jazz? Bite? Yeah, no, I don't have it. <laughs> I, I wish I did. I have a. Uh... Waka waka! <laughs> Got that. That's Fazzy Faz. Was that his name? Fazbear? Yeah. From the Muppets. Muppets. Freddy Fazbear. Yeah, it's Freddy Fazbear. Freddy Fazbear. The Muppets. What? The Muppets are puppets. Oh, it's Minecraft. We can continue talking. Yeah. <laughs> the Muppets. The Muppets. The Muppets. The Muppets. Tiff, the have you heard anything about GTA Six? Uh, no, no, I have not. Oh, you should definitely hear about GTA Six. Well, we did a podcast about it, <laughs> but... <laughs> oh, you haven't heard? Well, you should. You should. Um, but it's going to take place... It's awesome. I highly recommend looking into it, because I'm, I'm getting it. It's coming out later this year, apparently. Or next, early next year. Yeah, I had a feeling it was going to come out due to the fact that they released GTA V for free on Epic. I was like, that signals something. <laughs> like... Oh, oh, I didn't even think of that. That could be the reason why. Well, that's... They Dude, have... The fuck release of their release date right now is for, like, late summer 2020, as of my knowledge. Have they, they originally... Have they well, announced anything, or is this just articles that are speculating? No, there was a trailer. Yeah, there was a trailer. There's a trailer uh, later this year. I'm pretty sure they said later this year in the trailer. But I'm not 100% sure about that. Because I know people made, like, GTA 6 trailers for, like... No, this was, like, actually put out by no, Rockstar yeah, this was, yeah, this on their was, YouTube uh, channel. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm excited for it. I want... I can't wait to play it. It's gonna be amazing. I'm looking forward to GTA 6, but I'm looking more forward to Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Me too. Oh, yeah, I bro. can't wait for that to come out. I'm gonna be playing the fuck out of that for this channel. Hey. And it's multiplayer, so we could play together, my dude. Wait, where yes, is the GTA? Are you gonna watch it? <laughs> I want to go f put it on to watch later, but I don't see it on there. Do they have multiple channels? Just look up GTA 6 trailer. Website. I did. I'm getting from, like, random ass channels. Um, Alright, I have to pee real quick, so I'm gonna be right back. I don't know, dude. I don't know, fan. dude. I don't know, dude. This, this is fake. Um, maybe go to their website? Oh, maybe. Oh my god, a Rockstar website and do some Rockstar shit. Rock on! No! <laughs> wow. Way to hurt my feelings, Tiff. What the fuck? I hate you! <laughs> I hate you! Hate you too, honey. I hope your marinara sauce never sticks to your pasta. Good, because I don't like marinara sauce. <laughs> oh my god, the original Grand Theft Auto looks so... Damn. No, wait, that's the London one, isn't it? Fucking... Yeah, 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 that's the London one. There's one set in London? Yeah, it's an old... It's like one of their, like, their second or third game that came out. That's... It still has like the top down stuff. It's, it's called uh, Grand Theft Auto London 1969. Nice. Came, came out in 1999, April 6th, yeah. For the PC and the PS1. Nice. When did they, wait, when did the original Grand Theft Auto come out? 
1998. Okay, so it was the year before, which apparently was on the Game Boy Color. Really? I'm the same age as Grand Theft Auto. May 1st, 1998. Um, oh, no. It's older than me by a couple of months. And then and Grand Theft Auto 2, which was still top-down perspective, came out in October 27th, 1999. All right, so what's, what's going on here? We still, we still in the podcast? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about GTA, what? <laughs> oh, okay, cool. Yeah, 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 GTA. Um, do you ever play Chinatown Wars? Chinatown? I've heard yeah. of it, I think. GTA Chinatown Wars, yeah. I think it was, like, only on, uh, like, DS for some reason, I think. Oh, it was only on DS. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was iOS, Android, Kindle, PSP, and Nintendo DS, and it came out in 2009. I've heard of it. I've never played it. It's, it's a very strange one. I don't know. If, I think I only played a little bit of it. it wasn't that good? It was okay. Yeah. No, I don't have any. I don't see anything about GTA Six, but maybe I'm just bringing down. Or maybe we were trolled by the media. Probably. Damn the media and all of its cancer. Vice City was good. Liberty City. The episodes from Liberty City were good. Episode uh, GTA 4 was good. GTA 3 was good as well, actually. I used to play that one as well. It's funny, because, like, my, my, my dad had a PS2, so I used to play, like, the old, like, Grand Theft Auto games. I had uh, San Andreas for the PS2. Yeah, I never really got into San Andreas, like, until afterward, because, uh, my half-brother, who lives in my dad's house, because I don't live in my dad's house, um, got the game, so I ended up playing a little bit there, so I never, that's the one that I never actually was able to get fully into. I always play, like, GTA 3 and Vice City. Um, no, but I used to, like, it's funny, I used to, like, put in the cheat codes and stuff to get, like, fancy cars, but, like, that's literally Every, all I was Everybody cheat. did that. But, yeah, that was great. It's like, just give me the fancy car, that's all I want. Pretty much. That are the nice guns. The I, like, I, really like I even printed out, like, a whole sheet of, like, cheat codes, just so I could, like... I I used to have them written in a notebook. Yeah. Pretty funny. What's GTA in advance? Uh, I'm back. Online thing. Oh, okay. oh, it's a GTA that came out on the Game Boy Advance in 2004. Okay. What? GTA Advance. Yeah, and then there's GTA Chinatown. That came out. Yeah, we were talking about that one. That was on the iOS, the DS, Android, yeah. and PSP, I think, was the other one. I mean, yeah, GTA. What? Oh, shit. GTA is just one of those games that's just a it's, it's a staple, and it's always going to be around. I have a feeling. Like maybe, I don't see it going out of fashion anytime soon. Yeah, like there's always going to be a spot for those games that are like the thrill-seeking crime. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. The... That's why I like uh, shit like that. Is it lets you play a game and do virtually anything you want, crime wise. The weird the thing about the game is thing. it was originally made to. I think it was it was originally made to, like as a like a cops and robbers, uh, where you had, like two teams, and like the cops basically had to try to stop the robbers, but the robbers could do whatever they wanted. Oh, really? Yeah, see, I want to yeah. make a game that has that kind of style, but the cops and robbers are people, like players, and like there's a team of cops and a team of robbers, and the robbers are trying to escape. 
And oh, the cops stop them. That is right, what I have the one new idea, the bandits in space game, but... Y yeah. Bandits in space, huh? I haven't had time to make it. I haven't had time to, like, actually work on it, and, like, I don't have, like, a team, so it's, like... I need a team yeah. of people. Bandits in space. Because... Uh, I'm supposed to be drawing the prison schematics. Where'd you get that idea from? Uh, uh well, I, I mean, the name idea. Fucking, I think the name idea was actually kind of a joke to begin with. And then, like, I I made like a logo design, and we're like, wow. I was like, wow, that actually looks like good. Like, I I kind of like this name. <laughs> I'm really yeah, sad right. our pirate video game never won any. Hey man, if I had time, <laughs> and we would be like, hell yeah. I knew how to make a video game. Well, it's not that I don't know how to make a video game because I know how to make one. I've messed. I've dabbled in Unreal Engine multiple times. It's like, just when very time it. time consuming. Yeah. Very time consuming, and if you don't have like a whole team to work on it, you either need to be very dedicated to game making, or you need to have a whole team that can actually like work together on certain dates. Slowly get there. And Tiff can't afford to pay people. Exactly. I gotta get a new car. You gotta add a new car. What are you doing I now? A car. Huh? What? What? What'd you say? Oh, I asked Tiff what he's doing now. What am I doing? I'm, I'm chilling at like my I house. Gotta add a new car. I was like, what? No, I gotta get a new car. Uh oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My other car is like dying slowly. It's got like two. It's a Jeep Liberty Me from two thousand six. Two hundred and thirty thousand miles. It's like pushing its fucking limits right now. I mean, even even my mechanic was like, "Yeah, you're gonna want to replace the suit." I'm like, "Yeah, I know." Like I've been looking already. <laughs> Just like thanks, I needed to hear that. Buy a Subaru, <laughs> dude. Everybody's telling me to buy a Subaru. They're <laughs> so good. What the fuck? They're so, they're all wheel drive. They're cars, so they're not like big bulky <laughs> SUVs. I mean, if you're looking for an SUV, go with another Jeep. Not even like go with no, another, I don't Jeep. Want another Jeep. They're like Jeeps have their issues, but I'm not a big fan of Jeeps. I mean, I'm okay with them, but like, no. Like, well, my dad was a Jeep Dodge Chrysler mechanic, so he's really big on Jeep and Dodge. So that's he's just had Jeeps basically his whole life. But Jeeps are, if you get the older ones, they're good cars, but. They all have like two hundred thousand miles on them now, and are on their last legs, which sucks. But Subaru, I have a Subaru. I love my Subaru. Carly's got a Subaru. She loves it. I know several people who are just obsessed with Subarus. Yeah, I might try to. I'm probably, I might just. I mean, I gotta look for a used car because I can't buy. I can, I'm not buying a whole fucking new car right now. <laughs> but well, uh, depending on how much you have to spend, you can get like a halfway decent. Like I have a Subaru Forester from 2005. Like you can get one with a little bit. I mine has 186 thousand miles on it, and you can get one with like less miles on it because I paid two grand for my car, but I've also put like 10,000 miles on it. Right. But. Um, you can get, like, ones with, like, 150,000 miles for, like, 3,500 bucks, maybe, to four grand, like, with no issues or anything, like, 2005 to, like, 2008, because that was a good, that was, like, a good motor for them, that's, like, the best year you can buy Subarus from. Yeah, I'll wait for my tax return, and then once my tax return comes in start looking for the car officially i think probably like a month or two is when it'll be a uh... do you know what type of car you want just a car that works just that's a car all... that's got wheels that runs <laughs> yeah exactly one that could take me back and forth to work so that's the i don't need anything else nothing too crazy 
Well, that's it was always beaten to my head that like you have to take into account like we live in New Jersey and we get snow for oh, half the year you and out. yeah, you cut out. What? You cut out. Always beaten to your head. Oh, I've always had it beaten to my head that like we live in New Jersey. We it snows like half the year here, like <laughs> until it only snowed like three times this month. Yeah, this year. <laughs> But, like, that's, I always uh, was taught, like, you gotta account for that. So, like, you either have to have a car that you drive year-round that can deal with the snow, or have seasonal cars. And I can't afford to have seasonal cars. Yeah. I'm unemployed. I can't even afford to have my car. When do you start at Maven? Uh, I'm supposed to hear from them today. Oh, because I got hired already. I start Tuesday. Tuesday? Yeah. You lucky bastard. I started, I went through three jobs in one. <laughs> in like the span of like three weeks. No, no, not even. One week. Less than a week. This past week I've been. Yeah, because you got the job at a a Fence. What, on Friday? No, I started it on Monday. But yeah, when did you get the job though? On Friday, right? Uh, oh yeah, probably. Yeah, because I remember it was me, Friday. Whatever uh, day me, you, and Shannon went hiking. That was Friday, because my mom was home. Okay. And I remember you got the phone call Friday. You worked Monday. Is that why you don't have work today? No, the reason why I don't have work today is because uh, they don't need me the rest of the week, and I don't work there anymore. I had to quit because I start Tuesday. Wait, what are you talking about? Tony's? No, at a a Fence. No, they said they didn't need me tomorrow. And then I, I was uh, quitting because I'm starting Mavis on what was going to be Monday, but apparently Monday's a holiday. Yeah. Mondays. So, uh, Tuesday I start at Maybe. Do you want to get drunk on Monday? Is that even a question? Tim, do you want to get drunk on Monday? No, oh, man. <laughs> Loser. Hey, you know, I don't want to call you guys short, but I, uh, I got some stuff to do, so. It's um, no big. You yeah, it's all you. good. Cool. Just, uh, right. plug your channel and shite. Alright, I'll do a I'll do a good old fancy plug. Uh thank you guys for having me. Um if you wanna go check out some of my stuff, I'm usually over on Twitch over at uh, the Real Duck, um playing a lot of games with So if you wanna see a bunch of idiots have a good time, we're over there. Cool. Yeah. We'll probably see us over there. Yeah. Somewhere probably. Hell yeah. Get everything fixed. Yeah, I mean we're usually in my, my Discord server. If you if you guys message me I'll you want to join something? Just hit me up. We'll play. We'll make a plan. All right. I'll try not to abduct another one of your streams. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Peace All right, out. Have a nice rest of your day, Tim. Have a good one. Peace. All right. Time for that, us to sign off. We're rolling out. Yep. All right, everybody. Uh, uh, it was nice talking. I'm sorry that today's been a little uh, thrown together, more or less. It's, Things have been... it's because we were we're off a day, so it kind of caught us off guard because Jaden yeah. was working. And next week, hopefully by Tuesday, both of us will be starting full time. We'll actually be working at the same job. It's gonna be great. Unfortunately, well, not the same place. Yeah, but same we're job. Put down and uh, where'd my dad say you're gonna get moved to? To me, he said Parsippany. Parsippany, yeah. You're getting put in Parsippany. I'm getting put where Dez used to be in Dover. You know, Parsippany is a far fucking drive. Good thing I don't have to deal with it. No, but Dover's <laughs> almost just as far. Dover's closer to my dad works, so that. Yeah. That's oh, that means I'm you're gonna have to wait that for one. your dad to get out of work? No, I was told I'm being put on the same, uh. Some... Okay, that's not bad. Yeah. I know your dad said the Parsippany store is not far from where his store is either. So we're not very far. We can meet up for lunch. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs>
Carpool. Carpool the awake. All right, nobody. We'll catch you in the next one. Uh, go to our Instagram. Go to Instagram. Everything's gonna be in the description. Yeah, y'all know what to do. <laughs> Deuces. Deuces.